Yeah, so jumping right into it. Jumping straight into it. No intro to the stream. We're just we're just playing the video game because I wanna I wanna beat this chapter fast. Not fast, but you know, I'm still gonna go read dialogue and explore, but I wanna I wanna make some progress within the next two hours. That's my plan. I would like to knock this game out with or this chapter within two hours. Not the whole game within two hours. I'm pretty sure chapter five is gonna take a long time. Let me check something really quick. Hold on, something's up. I was like, this is still a Celeste song. I was like, why is there a Celeste song in the game? I fucking love Celeste, by the way. Some fun fact lore about me at Generation. Um, Celeste is one of my favorite video games of all time, for sure. Like, if I was ever to make a top 10 list, Celeste was probably up there somewhere. I don't know where in the top 10, but it's up there. I always, like, wanna... No, stop! Stop! So loud! Jesus. I always, like, thought, like... Like, if I make a top 10 list, I can't really pick a specific Pokemon game. I feel like I have to play Pokemon, like, as a whole is like a slot on that list it's just, it's like because if i was like oh top 10 games i'm like pokemon emerald pokemon soul silver pokemon black 2 like silly so i always think like pokemon as a whole what kind of as one game all right anyways enough about that let's play chapter three new get that mouse off the screen View the chapter three opening. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, let's look at the opening. Yeah. So what I'm guessing is I'm gonna play four different sets of kids, and then chapter five is gonna like probably have them all converge somehow, and then that's when like anything can happen. Like that's where like the ending is gonna matter. I feel like every chapter so far has like a set end until like the last chapter probably. And then that's when like who knows what'll happen. Oh, yeah. I can't take much more of this. What's wrong with the school? Who the hell was that? Why is he here? If we got hit with a hammer like that, we'd be goners. Oh, so they've seen the killer. I just want to check something really quick in my settings before I continue. Um, oh, properties that looks good. I need to check this one. No, just that's weird. Oh, it's this one. Uh, filters, it's not on. Okay, cool. All right. I just noticed, uh, oh, so I, do I have, let me see something. Let me see if I have a command. Socials? No. Social? Oh, I need to update that. I don't even think that Discord. It's because I uploaded a TikTok the other day and I noticed that, like, the audio was desynced. I don't know. I think that happened when rendering it out for some reason. I'm not sure what happened. It's like, it's really subtle. It's something that I always fucking notice, but I don't think anybody else really cares about it. But I realized I need to update my social command with TikTok on there. I don't promote that anywhere. I should. Okay, let's play the video game. Don't worry about him. He was just here. I don't remember these two. Are these other characters? These might be the previous kids. Honestly, if I was, I think I would be okay if I got transported to another dimension and was being chased by a murderer. I think that'd be a good way to die. Oh, Jesus. I had to have been from that hammer. Don't think about it, please. Damn it, where did everybody go? Oh, what? Look, Fukuriki, look, the hallway. It, it can't be. Sorry. Change more settings really quick. Okay. I think I think I should be good. The corridor it grew. What is No 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 the other way. Look down the hall. 
something's something's coming. Oh, I skipped that scream. That would have been a good scream. Dude, this killer sounds actually kind of scary. <laughs> happening what the hell is going on oh this is going to be kind of scary isn't it to take her head. Hello? So the way this is sound engineered, it's playing through only the left side. So that means she answered the phone and put it to her left. But, like, when I answer my phone, like, ring, ring, hello, I go to my right ear because I'm right-handed. So does this mean Naomi's left-handed? It doesn't fucking matter. I'm just curious because that's just how it plays in my headset. I just only heard it in this ear. I was just curious. Unless my right headphone doesn't work. Oh, it works. It just... It's just everything's on the left side for some reason. Okay, so that's back to normal. It's just the phone. It, I mean, that's cool sound design. It's like, of course you only hear it through one ear. This is in 2008, by the way. Oh, that's not through the phone, right? So we're playing as Naomi again? My theory of what was going to go on in this game is just... Slowly falling apart. I might not be able to predict how the game's gonna play out, but at least I'm the Daryl Dixon. Oh, Jesus. I don't understand. Honestly, me neither. It really is a pity. <gasps> who are you? I'm the spirit of a girl who died here. Oh, hey, it's the author. Do you know what happened to her? I believe your friend was afflicted. With what? 
So it's a terrible curse called Ligma. She had it. She didn't want to tell you. She had Ligma. It was a bad case of Ligma, man. She, I, I tried to help her myself with it, but like, there's no known cure for Ligma. And then she goes, Ligma? What's, what's Ligma? And she goes, Ligma balls! And then, yeah. <laughs> Those who are touched by it slowly lose their minds to it. Some people realize this is happening and go to the great lengths to prevent it, even taking their own lives. Of course, others just go insane. Oh, so we've seen one person end it, and we see another person going insane. We're seeing both ends of the coin. Sometimes they start hurting the people around them. The exact response to curse varies quite a bit from one person to the next. That's horrible. Now that your friend has passed away, the school, the space, is yours alone. You are its only living occupant. N no. You will be all by yourself from here on out until the day you die. I, I think solitude sounds nice. That sounds really good. I, would, I wouldn't mind that. The cell phone does have Seiko's number stored in it, and everybody else's too. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I mean, it happened in Amori, so... <laughs> Sound, was that my leg? What did... Oh god. What did you do? Ew. Is this her ghost, or is she imagining this voice? I'm not tough at all. We haven't seen Satoshi at all. Chapter 3. Oh, hey, it's Satoshi. You're doing great, Yuka. I'm really impressed how long you've gone without crying. Oh, this is his little sister. I'm not crying. I'm not. Since that other corporeal beings such as yourselves were brought here as well. Nine in total, nine poor souls pulled in at once. That would be me and Yuka, Naomi, Yoshiki, Shinazaki, Misu Yue, Shinohara, Suzumoto, and Moru Shige. In other words, everybody in the room at the time. Yeah. So everybody else is in the school too? Yeah. Not exactly. As I mentioned, this is the nexus of closed spaces. Your friends are scattered among them. So in essence, they are indeed all in the school, but it's not quite the same place for everyone. Meeting anyone else here may prove difficult. If you should attempt to defy the will of the school to find them, you may ultimately invoke its wrath, and that's a fate best avoided. We have to try anyway. Like, we're gonna die no matter what, right? So why not I at least try? We'll do whatever it takes to find everyone and get out of here. Big brother. They're all such good people. They've done nothing to deserve this. And I absolutely will not give up on them just because there's some nebulous curse that might strike back at me. It's a rarity to find such righteous determination these days, but you don't lose it along the way. You desire not to let a single person die. Try to retain that noble spirit no matter what horrors may await. And even if you can't save everyone, you may still be able to alter your fate for the better, even if only by the tiniest of margins. Just don't end up like us. Dude, I like this ghost. What a nice ghost. What is it? What did he mean by this school's wrath? I'm not sure. Is he saying the school has a mind of its own or something? Yes. At any rate, we should try to find Miss Yue and the others as soon as possible. And we need to get you home too. If we come across a way out of here, I want you to take it. There may be an entrance way or an emergency accident or roof access or something that leads outside. And if so, you're going straight home. No buts. Capiche?
There's a tiny key, but the cabinet itself is locked. Interesting. Good thing to notice. There's a bridge panel right there. Horrible incident. I remember hearing about this from Shinazaki during one of her candlelight vigils. Alright. So I need to for sure go down here. Let's look at the bucket. It's empty. Good to know. It hasn't been peed in yet. So I need to get up there. There's no way to get up there yet. There's probably going to have to be some sort of earthquake. And then it'll probably give me access. Unless there's like a secret entrance way. So I got messages. Oh, a child, <laughs> a child. That's me when I see a kid and her dress looks pretty old fashioned. Big brother. Uh, it's okay. She's gone now. We'll be fine. All right, so now we're going to have to deal with a, with a child spirit in a red dress. Good to know. I don't see why we can't just pick up a chair or push a chair or climb over these, any of this. See, if I was the, if I was in this universe, I'd be climbing shit, dude. I'd be Daryl. I kind of want to replay that Walking Dead game that they made, like, around season three, maybe, of The Walking Dead. Where it was just like, you play as Daryl Dixon before he meets up with the main group. That game is not a good game, but it was a fun game. Oh, hey, a body. <gasps> Ow, you hurt my hand, big brother. You could don't look. She already looked, man. It's not a prop or anything. It's a real dead body. Fun fact. I've seen a dead body. And you might be like, yeah, well, everyone's been to a funeral. No, I've stumbled upon a dead body before. It is kind of fucking freaky. I, was, I wasn't like this. I wasn't like... Hah! Hah! But I was like, oh, fuck, Ooh, dead guy. I've actually kind of like half, I've seen a body and a half. I saw another dead body, like a few years prior. I wasn't like up close to that one though. It was like in the distance and it was like a cop pulling him out. I was like, oh shit. I'm going to end up like this too. Are all of us going to die here? Shout out to Sauce God Toast telling me to delay the stream. All right, guys, I just got a tweet. Um, Sauce God Toast is busy, and so like I can't stream if he's busy because he wants to watch the stream. So I'm just gonna play this song that he made for me, and we're just gonna end the stream early. I'll be back later when he's not busy, you know. So uh, yeah, Sauce God Toast. Tweet me whenever you're uh, ready for the, for the stream. And uh, I'll be live later. I'm kidding. That's... We're not fucking doing that. Suck. <laughs> Sucks to suck. Yuka, it, it's okay. Come on, Yuka. We're leaving this room. Also, this is the first time I tweeted. Tweeted. Fuck. Gone live like earlier in the day. I usually go live like in the evening. And then I'm doing like an early afternoon. It's feels nice. I was in the stream in the morning yesterday, but let's do story time. I was going to go live yesterday, but uh, there was a leak in our roof. And like, it was pretty bad. Like it was already like split open. It was like, and it was all wet and warped. Like the whole, well, not the whole ceiling, but a good section of the ceiling. So I had to get maintenance in here and wait for them. And they came and then they patched it. And I was like, oh, maybe I could stream now that they patched it. And they're like, we'll be back in two hours to paint it. And I was like, oh, so they'll be back. So I just didn't stream yesterday morning. And I was going to stream this morning. 
Uh, but my cat peed on the couch and had to go get some stuff to clean it and whatnot. And now he's sleeping right here. Not this cat. This cat's an angel. The other cat who's off screen. So I was like, well, I was in the stream like six hours for this morning. But I guess a two hour, three hour evening stream will have to suffice. So, you know, it is what it is. All right. Let's get out of this room. All right, candle. I'm going to save on each one, and then once I get further in, I'll start overriding saves, I guess. There's a corpse roll on the ground, decomposing rapidly. It's clenching a letter in its hand. Dear brother, I regret that we couldn't see one another again before my death. I no longer have the energy to move, and I'm so desperately thirsty. My tongue started swelling up like a sponge and it keeps cutting off my air. I'd find it fascinating if I would stop nearly suffocating me. I just want something to drink. Anything. Heck, I'd even drink that scary orange juice from the back of the fridge right about now. Thought she was going to say the bucket. There's not a drop of anything to be found. I'm so thirsty. It's actually making me nauseous, huh? I just hope at least you can make it out of your life. Oh yeah, we can see how many uh, name tags there are. Chapter 3, there's a fucking lot. I'm not I'm not determined to collect all of them. Death is blind, it comes for all souls, regardless of their worth or lack thereof. I'm playing this game to just experience the story and get an ending. I'm not looking to get every single thing. Oh, victims' memoirs. Oh, didn't mean to collect that, but I did. All right, let's go back, I guess. Surely at some point there's going to be an earthquake. There's always an earthquake. Or I'm going to get jump scared by that girl in the dress. You go. Break brother, but we better to go home again. Who fucking knows, man? It took a while in Digimon Survive for us to get home, and now everybody went home. It's not true, right, Big Brother? Right? How should I know? I'm still trying to figure things out myself. Ah. Oops. Did not mean to say that. What's wrong with me? What good is upsetting you're gonna do? If Naomi heard me say that to my little sister, she'd smack me upside the head. Sorry, Yuka, I didn't mean it, honest. It's just that I'm I'm scared too. Please don't cry. But you hurt my feelings. I'm really sorry. It's just you talked about us dying. And since we just saw a real dead body, I guess it shook me up worse than I thought. It's a good apology. Big brother, you really are a scaredy cat, huh? Sorry. You know what, maybe showing some honesty and harsh emotions was the good choice to make, you know? Alright, let's see if I can access this board yet. Is it me or is that board moving? Yeah, it was on this side a minute ago. Oh! You gotta do the whole ambush thing again. Maybe we can ambush it. Let's try to find the exact spot where it was sitting before. I think it's... Like right here. Hold on. I should memorize where it is right now. It's like right below that left desk. Okay. Right Don't worry, I'll be right back. I just had a thought, that's all. You bet. The board's gonna eat her. It's gonna kill her. It's the the board's possessed. Yuka! Yeah. The loose board. 
Alright, so we're gonna use it down here. Wait a second, big brother. This is for you. Such a cute little bottle. Well, you see, it's my favorite. It's my secret charm. It's full of scented beads. Oh, there's sure a lot of them in here. Give it a sniff. Ah, oh, caramel. I don't have a sense of smell, fun fact. Isn't it neat? She probably spent her allowance at that stationary shop in town again. Caramel flavor is special. It protects you from accidents and shields you from danger. That's why I want you to have it. This place is frightening you? Don't worry, I'll be alright. You should hang on to it yourself. I really don't mind. You take it. I just... I don't want anything to happen to my big brother. You're a scatterbrain. You always get freaked out so easily and it really scares me. Her whole body is quaking in fear. She really wants him to take it. I'll take it. Alright, I guess I can borrow it for a little. Take good care of it, okay? Caramel flavor will keep you safe, but that's not all. Want to know what else it does? It's a secret. If I tell you, you'll get all bothers, so I'm not gonna. Something that would bother me more than calling me a scatterbrain. Scented beads. It probably attracts women. This is bored. And go this way. There's the earthquake. It was I didn't need the earthquake to get the board, but I did protect the earthquake would happen. Another earthquake. Yuka, grab my hand. I wanna be in an earthquake so bad. Dude, the fact that California got hit by the hurricane and earthquake at the same time is fucking crazy. I thought that was so crazy. Oh, hey. A convenient path. But what if there's another convenient path behind us now? Let's check it out. We could have changed something else. And if not, I could at least save. Ugh. Give me a second save right here. Is that looking here? The Ballad of Bad Evil Bunny. Book of Beetle Wings. There's some books. Finally, no hair for once. Nothing changed this way. Bruh, that bug sound is gross. Okay, I was just checking, and I, I thought I could get a save out of it, too. Um, let's check the classroom, too, just in case anything changed in here. Maybe this opened. Doesn't seem like it. Ugh. <sighs> All right, let's see what uh, downstairs has for us. Oh, hey, a body. Yoshike, Yoshike, I'm so sorry. If only I hadn't discovered that stupid charm. Or do we not just give it a charm? Uh. You missed the final bell. You missed the end of school. If you're still here, then you always will be. Let's ignore the dead girl and see what's down here. Oh my god, why is it so dark? Oh, th those are memoirs. I probably shouldn't read those. I feel like the scary thing that's going to happen in this section of the game is I'm going to be chased through the dark or something. Uh, It's all backwards. Every shelf of every cabinet, you must turn every page and 
rifle through if you wish to learn from learn more about this school every shelf of every cabinet you must turn every page so i, I gotta read the books um who've who've become trapped within these walls any message messages have been left behind by the others free of the curse may you use their words as a guide to help break so I gotta read. Gotta read books. Got it. Excuse me. Just gonna ignore that guy. Dirty husk left behind by the soul, filthy, disgusting carbon dust, repulsive bag of meat and tissue, yet one must scrub and clean it well. Present it at the moment of salvation, for the Lord doth watch over us always. Cool. That's that's some real nice poetry. This is a dead end. Wait. It's not. Let's see what's this way. Main building, second floor, East Hall. Oh, there's an infirmary. Why does he... Dude, so yeah, the fucking hard part of this chapter is going to be losing the light. Why is it dark over there? Oh, can't go that way. Let's go up this way. Oh, hey, body. Oh, hey, what's this? Unknown key. It might open that cabinet to get the small key. Nothing good's gonna happen up here. Big brother. What's up? I have to go potty. That's... Br just go in the... We could go to the bucket. The bucket's always a good place to potty. She has to go pee-pee like my cat on the couch this morning. I hate asking such a personal question, but this place is full of surprises. I need to know how long to wait before getting worried. And already? Big brother, I couldn't go. What's in here? Oh, yeah. Seriously? Yeah, that place is fucked up. It's in our bathroom. Okay, can you hold it? Just go in the corner. Be nice at the boys' room or an option at least. I think we gotta go to the bucket. I hate when the floor creaks. I keep thinking it's gonna like collapse. All right, we gotta walk past that ghost again. I don't like that it does that. Why is it doing it in that spot only? It's fucking weird. It's gonna get me. It's gonna surprise me of something one of these times. Alright, let's hope the ghost doesn't give us too much attention.
Okay, you're standing now. Oh, like a bucket. She doesn't want to pee in the bucket. All right, fine. Don't pee in the bucket. Your loss. The perfectly good bucket for peeing. Let's see if we could open this. Can we go in there? Well, there's still one path I haven't gone up yet. But I also... I'm gonna go back up here, check out this room. Stuff changes when you do certain actions, so. Ah. Also save again. Oh, just checking. Trying to be thorough. It's very easy to miss something in this game and for it to hold you back. So I got an important work related group time message. He's not standing now. Climbing over, it's far too risky? Then fucking jump. Let's see if there's anything different down here. I did not mean to read this. There's a hallway somewhere in here that changes its size, appearing longer or shorter, pretty much on a whim. So there's a fucking weird ass hallway. Good to know. I've gotta find the weird ass hallway. He stands up. He stands up when we go this way. Will he sit down again? Weird. Alright, so I guess our, our quest right now is to figure out where the key goes and where my little sister can pee. I'm just wondering. Oh, I could probably open one of these. Oh, there we go. Nothing good has ever happened in this room. Sure, Naomi. Naomi. All right. Third candle. Gets on it. There's a blood splattered notebook on the desk with the word diary written in bold letters at the top, like some sort of prop. However, it's practically molded into the desk. It can't be moved or opened. One monthly goal, wash your hands and so that should be a daily goal. Pee on the bed. <laughs> Alright, if we're gonna start sleeping, we gotta take naps and shifts. That's what Daryl will do. Daryl will be like, I'll get first watch. I might even go hunt some squirrels.
You want to serve me too, big brother? Well, I'm not tired. I don't think it's a good idea for both of us to sleep. And like I said, I'm the Daryl Dixon of this universe. I know what to do instinctually, and I think only one of us should sleep. Yeah. Yeah, me saying I'm not tired doesn't mean I'm going to go wander around without her. Bruh, I'm so glad this girl's smart. Oh. Do I, do I read this? Let's read it. Poor children abducted and killed follow. Poor to brew shocking listeners. Yep. Some things have been notes. These are like notes, like somebody was trying to solve it. Maybe the author girl. What is it? Source into the sticky residue. Is that something or more likely someone who dragged down the hall? A metal tool of some sort. Is it a crowbar? Yeah. We could go to the men's bathroom now. Here's a creepy hallway. There's a large black stain on the wall. It looks almost organic, but it's not actually wet, and there's no indication of how it got there. I know how it got there. Trust me, I know. Dude, it's so weird. It's making that all, like, invisible. It's like you're playing Among Us and somebody turned the lights off. Oops. I'm just being a silly goose. Don't mind me. Alright, so in this. Yes, you got. Turn those stalls. All right, you gotta, you gotta hike up that leg. All right. Just pee in the sink. Pee on the floor. Pee down a hole. There are literally like. 200 options of how to pee, but they just so fixated on using it specifically on a toilet in a stall. I have friends who have or who are women and have peed in urinals. Well, if you can't hold any longer, then how about I wait outside and you do what you've got to do? I'll keep holding it. Okay, but don't strain yourself. When you gotta go, you gotta go. She's like a sim who refuses to like fulfill their needs. I'm not reading that. Those who choose to ignore the darkness that dwells in the hearts of a man may be stuck forever in a loop. For in this world, there are some truths that simply must be known, no matter how disturbing, but curiosity can be deadly, and other truths are best left untold. Yeah. Yeah, so I... I really want to read the memoirs. They're fun to read, but I understand that bad things apparently happen if you do. But at the same time, what if I do? I feel like if I want to experience this game, I should at least read one set of memoirs all the way through, right? <laughs> like, I've never found three in a row. Because apparently if you miss one, then they just disappear. So, why not at least try to read all five? I got the save points. I can reset. 
Mitsuharu I really isn't anywhere to be found, is he? I guess it's true. I'll probably never see him again. But I may figure out a way of getting in contact with him. He left a message on the teacher's desk in one of the classrooms. Looks like even when we're in different spaces, we can still communicate that way. But it's not enough. There's no warmth to be felt from the written world alone. I miss our fights, our impromptu wrestling matches, but it's not just the physical contact. What I want more than anything is to see his face again. I just want to be able to see him around and make small talk, ask him how he's been and what he plans to do after school. Those simple everyday interactions are some of the most precious memories now, what I wouldn't give to have those days back. Funny what runs through your head when you're trying to make frostbitten fingers move without cracking off. Alright, so maybe I'll find the last two. Maybe the fourth one spawns in here now. Yeah, no, this bathroom's fucked up. Ew. With gum still attached. Ew. Ew. Imagine going to a sink and there's just teeth with the gums attached. That's just so gross. That is disturbing. All right. Well, let's carry on. Oh, I realize we still have the crowbar too. It didn't break. Someone just, someone just take a photo of me. Did somebody just take a photo with me without my permission? Definitely sounded like a camera. Anything over here? No. No. Morishige. You're okay. Mokita, you as well. I'm sort of relieved to see someone else from class. Yeah. No. <laughs> Jesus. It's just ketchup. Somebody threw... Somebody threw their hot pocket at the wall, right? Is it? <laughs> Last night's pozole. It's just... They spilt the pozole. You ever watch the episode of The Office and he spills the beans everywhere? <laughs> he spilled the beans everywhere. It's an awful sight, isn't it? Seems like pulverized human remains to me. There's a bit of breast meat mixed in, so I'm guessing female breast meat. How could you distinguish that? Never thought I'd see something so horrific makes you want to throw up. At any rate, I'm glad you're all right. Have you found anyone else? I'm afraid I haven't. I only just awoke in here a short while ago and haven't encountered a single other soul. Same story as us, then. My sister and I haven't come across anyone else yet. So you haven't seen Mayu yet? Isn't that, isn't that Mayu? Isn't that Mayu right there? Isn't Mayu the Pasole? The poor girl, I'm sure she's in here somewhere. Yep. She's somewhere, alright. I need to find her. I need to be with her. I'm certain Susan one of us be thinking the same thing about you. How about we look for her together? Yeah. No, if we're split up, that raises the odds of stumbling upon someone else. So I'm going to continue to search by myself. Classroom 1A is an official rendezvous point. If you find any of the others, tell them we're, uh, we'll be gathering together there. And we'll do the same. Sounds like a plan. Is it throw up? Yeah, sure. That boy, he was taking... I'm sure it wasn't what it looked like. Come on, let's go, okay? The fuck was that? Is a fucking car driving to the building? Oh, yeah. I hate the music in this room so much. Um, Yeah, let's just do the fourth one. I think I'll use the third save as, like, if I need to go back and make different decisions. I'll go to the third save. Yeah, I was like, this looks different. The hallway got bigger. I had a body. Hmm. 
The door's locked. I wonder how often it changes size. That might be a little puzzle. Oh, that kid. He's going to start chasing us. I'm going to go down. Like this room's going to come into play somehow, right? Alright, I already read these ones. I just wanted to make sure. I'm gonna make sure I'm not missing anything. Still too risky to go that way, apparently. Yeah, my neck was tickling and there was a bug. There was a bug. I just crushed it. I don't even know what kind of bug it was. Like, look. I squished the bug. He's dead. He's been murdered. Ah. Let me go clean up. I just got chills thinking about the bug on my neck. What's scarier than ghosts and murderous uh, serial killers? Uh, bugs. Just I'm actually not afraid of bugs. I'm afraid of spiders. So I'd probably be afraid of a scorpion too. But otherwise, other bugs, they just don't bother me that much. I mean, when they're on your neck, it's kind of like, ah! But not really... I don't know what it was. Um, nothing. It was nothing I was afraid of. Oh, here we go. We got a tiny key. A golden sheen. And a very distinctive shape. It looks like it goes to like a toy, like a wind-up toy. Regrettably, the nail puller broke on impact as well. I smashed the glass and the crowbar just fucking shattered apparently. The excuses that this game like develops comes up with to like hinder you. They're like, man, if they had a crowbar like 24-7, they'd be OP. But we gotta like nerf them somehow. I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk to you. Read it or don't read it. I've gone this far without reading it. Let's actually overwrite this one. And then let's read it. Kill me, please. Kill me, please. Kill me, please. Kill me. Can't take anymore. Can't take anymore. Can't take anymore. Let me out. Huh. That wasn't creepy at all. Can I go this way yet? These are the first memoirs. Alright, well I gotta go figure out where this little key goes. Ah, that bug gets me every time. 
it literally like there's no like physical like jerking or like scary but it gives me goosebumps every time it happens it makes me get the eebie-jeebies you give me the heebie-jeebies you give me the heebie-jeebies you give me the heebie-jeebies please leave us alone like a weird ambient noise in here. Maybe there's something in the infirmary that I'm going to be able to hook the key up to. So the neighbors above me have a dog and I just faintly heard barking, but I had my headset on. So I was like, is that in the game? Or maybe it opens this door. Oh, yeah. Look at that. There's like noises upstairs. I don't know what the dog's doing. Woke up my cat. Oh, we're outside. <laughs> Freezing out here. A second wing, huh? Can't believe the school is this big. Are you alright? I'll be fine. Maybe it'll be a faculty bathroom. Seems like we could climb this fence pretty easily and get the hell out of here. But look at these woods. It's like they go on forever. And they're completely surrounding this whole building. Oh, you know what that reminds me of? I'm just fucking... Has anybody seen The Society on Netflix? There's only one season. It came out like in 2019, I think. Like end of 2019. It might have even come out... No, I think it came out 2019. It was just like, it's kind of the same premise as this game a little bit, or maybe like Digimon Survive kind of a little bit, where these high school students went on a field trip and they like all fell asleep on the bus. And when the bus got to the location and they got on the bus, they were just back at their hometown where they left and the buses drove off, but it was just the kids and everybody of the adults were all gone. All their houses were exactly how they left them. And they just had to create this society of just these high school kids in this town and it was a great show what a great concept they start partying like crazy and then they start trying to make a government and there's like murder that happens and went on a mystery and it's such a good show and season one wraps up and it's like a little bit on a cliffhanger and then they drop like a bomb of information to like kind of stir the mystery of what's going on and then they're like yep season two we're gonna film it in 2020 and then covid happens and netflix goes damn we're just going to cancel it, you know, because it's going to be kind of expensive to get this show on season two. And they canceled it. And I'll never know what happens, except apparently they're making a comic book. I haven't heard much about that. It's been like a rumor, but I hope it's true. Anyways. Oh, also like the entire town surrounded by like endless woods. That's what made me think of it. So it's not even like they could go to the next town over because it doesn't exist. It's just all trees. And that becomes kind of like part of the show too. Like what what else could be out there? I guess now's not the time to be worrying about that. Anyway, first things first, let's take care of Yuka's predicament. Let's go. Just walk in the rain and pee. I was probably trained by peeing outside, fun fact. This place doesn't feel right at all. The air is really thick. Oh, baby brother, my head hurts. It feels like it's going to split open. Mine too and my ears are ringing. I don't think it's safe to be in here for very long. Do you want to wait back in the main building? I never get the feeling you'd be safe from there. No, let's stay together. Alright, let's make this the fifth save. Stay away from that. That is a danger. The cabinets are dangerous, alright? Staff room.
All right, on the thing over here. Music room. Wait, did the door open? Sounds like a door opens and then locks if you go back. Oh, this one? It's weird how many similarities there are to Digimon Survive in this game. Interesting. That was the room we're just in. I'm just curious if any of these opened. Okay, it sounded like a door opened and then it sounded like a door locked, but then there hasn't been any other sounds and there is one door open. One 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 two 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 three 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 four 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 five 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 six 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 seven 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 eight 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 nine nine eight. There's only two nines. This probably means something. Oh cool. Dark and scary here. There's a decaying corpse sitting in the chair. Cody. Cody. Almost sounds like my name. I'm right here. Just if you want to see Colin, just go to twitch.tv slash hatch generation. You could see this guy right here. Anyways, I got their name type. It goes upstairs really fast. Anything else here? Do I get to go on the roof? Let's see what's in here. Fuck this room. It is so dark. Oh, it's like a paint. It's an art room. It's a plaster bus, cheap and mess produced for use in still life paintings. Oh. You know, ah, that case, I fucking I tried to hold it, but like the chills had to escape me. Woo! That like that was that's creepy. That that like imagine seeing that like with your own eyes and like oh gosh, like if you immerse yourself, this some of this shit's creepy. Oh. I see her. I don't recognize the school uniform, but she looks like a living person at least. We should talk to her. I don't think we should. Hey. We're students from school called Kisaragi Academy, and uh, we performed a ritual with some of my classmates and lost consciousness, and when we woke up, we found ourselves trapped here. Was it the same for you? The expression isn't changing. Something's wrong. A female student is staring intently at the corner of the room, opening and closing her mouth rapidly as if chanting an incantation. Yeah, let's just... uh. I'll just leave her alone. I think leaving her alone is a good thing. She's going through something. Any books? I was told to read the books. Anybody else like standing in a corner of the room? Oh, hey. <laughs> um. Your brother is somebody else. I guess there are a lot of other people who were brought here, too. Let's follow her. But what's up here? Huh. Oh! Those hurt. Good to know. Good to know. Don't step on the green faces. Don't step on the green faces. That's a good life lesson.
Hey. I don't. Sorry to approach you out of nowhere like this, but we're students from a school and, uh... What's wrong? Okay. One. I don't know what that means. Let's read this ripped up poster. Girls divorce for you. No unauthorized teasing and trickery. You gotta get that shit authorized first. Oh, another real quick. I'm guessing we don't want to get trapped in here. That <laughs> very well. Oh, cool. That's how earthquakes work. We go up. Could have gone down or up. I chose up. Principal's office. Well, if I ever need to go to the principal's office, I now know it's on the third floor. All right, let's go down here. Now, for a game called Corpse Party, I've yet to see any parties. Where's the laboratory? Any and all students responsible for damaging these facilities will be reprimanded. Oh. Can't use these stalls in where you can climb under. Oh, I wonder if the earthquake maybe fixed the girls' bathroom. Maybe that's the puzzle. Maybe if you keep going forward, you'll go crazy and die. But if you go backwards... Use the bathroom and you could get out of here. I think that was it, yeah. The door doesn't seem like it even has a lock yet. It's not budging the slightest bit. Its entire surface is littered with protective paper charms. Spiritual confinement, banishment of malice, metaphysical barrier, Buddha's guardianship, charm of exorcism. What the hell? Why are all these protective seals? Is there something inside? Well, how about we don't open it? I could also try to see if I could get in the staff room now, maybe? I'm going to backtrack a little bit before I go too deep. I feel like it's a trap if you go too deep. I'm trying to be smart. Don't step on them. There's so many of them. Let's go back up a floor or down a floor. Yeah, down a floor. I was hoping, oh, it's still the music room. I was hoping one of these rooms would be accessible now. Because he mentioned the faculty bathroom. I'll look in the music room again.
weird. As soon as you step in that spot, it ends. I wonder if that's part of a puzzle. Or if it's just there to be creepy. It's hard to tell. I never know. I never know. It's hard to know. Alright, well, I guess let's uh, keep going. Keep pushing through this part of the school. Do we go in here? Good。けれども私たちの存在は小さな小さな色。その場に合わせた鳥たちは無造無造の波に飲まれて私の体はただ生き死にを繰り返す。幸の気持ちはとても嬉しい。だけどそれ以上の行いは戦いしないように助かる
All right, where can I go next? There's still the infirmary. Man, they have two different wings of the school to explore at the moment. It could literally be anywhere. I don't know. I mean, I came back and it triggered a little cutscene. So maybe I am supposed to be over here. Let's go up here. Still won't climb that. I check down here. Nothing. I need to check upstairs with the bathrooms. Fuck this room. <laughs> In the sink. So you have another yuck. Keep wondering if the earthquake opened up other paths. Alright, check the bathrooms. If nothing, I'll go back to the east wing. Let's see what's going on over there. Anything different in here? Let's hope it was number five. Oh. Yeah, that's a good reason not to be on this. Yeah, you don't want to use those ones anyways. They're haunted. Alright, back to the east wing I go. That's stuck. Dude, what's that sound? Sometimes there's like a rattle. All right, back in here. Did I read this? It's probably some sort of hint, but I don't know. I feel like I gotta get into the staff room somehow. Let it play it its song. Maybe it's a good luck song. Playing a song that enchants us with good fortune. I can only hope. I can only hope. Thank you. 
I know showing these paintings was like horrifying. I don't see anything on any of them. I just want to see if she said anything else. Boom, boom. Can't go up here. What if I walk through all that? YOLO! Nope. <laughs> I died to the green faces. I was just- I just had to see! Wrong end! It was a risk I was willing to take. I now know there's something over there though. Press any button. Go with the chapter three. This is the most recent one. I had a terrible vision. I do want to go back really quick though. And trigger that one cutscene. Because it might be mandatory before something else could happen. You go. And then let's go back. Because nothing else happened when I went over there. There was like nothing new. No interactions, if anything else. I'm just going to do that scene and then come back this way. Go oh, this way. Go back in here. Thank you, just go in the corner or something. Okay, we're gonna go outside. Finally, gee, I've had the solution. As always in Corpse Party, I have the solutions way before the characters get the solutions. It's all you, I'll be with you right here. You shouldn't have any trouble going over the fence, right? <laughs> If anything happens, yell really loud and I'll come get you. She's dead. Oh, I get the pleasure. You don't have to get over it, just pee. Oh. What the fuck is my brother at? That's why you never split up. So she's gonna run into the wall. <laughs> I wish I was a boy. I wonder if I should save as her now. Do the second one. I don't think I'll have to ever... I think I'll ever have to go that far back. I knew that cabinet was going to be fucking dangerous. I called it. Can't trust these cabinets. 
It doesn't have a book in it. It can't be trusted. There's a down? Oh, I thought it was the 5 out of 5. I want to read the 5 out of 5. I want to know what happens. It deletes your entire save. They're like, bro, we told you not to and you did it. So you got to be punished. Does she end up going in here? Is that what's supposed to happen? Oh. Do you have a knife? You're Mochita's sister. I sure this place is going to drive us all batty to think there'd be a corpse like this so close by. You're shaking. What happened to Mokita? He's gone away somewhere. I don't trust him at all. He's just taking photos of dead girls? Like... Poor thing. Come with me. I'll help you find him. Don't. No, I'll be okay. I'll search him by myself. Nope. Bad. Oh god, I was like, is he gonna chase me this way? I have to hide. It's like I'm going to burst. Just pee on him. Do I just go back outside? Um. Friendly? Friendly? Maybe I just gotta hide in the bathroom. Oh my god, it scared the fuck out of me. Oh, I'm terribly sorry. Big brother, you lied. You lied to me. You said you wouldn't leave me by myself. Not your big brother. Who the fuck is this guy? Who's this fucking handsome looking motherfucker? That's not my big brother. I'm sorry. I'm My name's Yuka Machida. Mine's Yuya Kazami. I'm an 11th grader at Byokudon Senior High. Yuka hmm? You were also spirited away here. And that you called me big brother a moment ago, I assume he's come here with you? You poor girl, I've also become separated from my little sister, and then presently searching for her. Jeez. If you like, you may accompany me. We'll look for your big brother along the way. In a place like this, after all, the living should stick together as much as possible. That's what I've been fucking saying since chapter one. My poor sister's probably off someone crying. Well, I know where one girl is. Alright, well, I get to be this handsome guy now. Let's save over here. Actually, I think I could save right here. I think I keep this third save in the infirmary. That might be a point worth backing over. Oh, he's strong. <laughs> Dude, being a senior has its perks. Well, let's check out the music room. There's a, there's a shy ghost that just wants to play its song, and we're not letting it. Um, maybe check out the fucking creepy girl in the painting room. Maybe that's his sister. Or the body we found is his sister. And maybe this guy would go fucking crazy. Being his dead sister, who knows. Let's, let's start with the painting room. Wasn't this inside the art room before? 
What's the matter? I was definitely in the art room before. I wish I knew. There, there's probably a way to solve that puzzle. Oh. I'm guessing somehow this girl, the little girl, went, hopped over to another parallel universe. There's an item up there. I want to get it somehow. Um, Are you all right? This is terrible. Have you seen the ghost of the children? I've been reading the school flyers and dying messages scattered throughout the school. And it seems the ghost of the man who killed the children is in here somewhere as well. He's apparently quite large and wields a hammer. He'd best be on your guard. I've had a great many of my friends, many, many people killed by that man and those wretched children. At any rate, it seems clear we should stick together, as there's simply no telling what may happen if we part ways. I wish I knew what that meant. I was just wondering if you'd have a comment about it. Well, this guy's a bad guy all along, and I was supposed to let the other guy touch me. And he'd protect me. Imagine. So are we just doing a lap around this part of the school? Maybe I gotta go back to the first wing. Check in here. Nada. Alright, having done a lap, let's save over this one again. And then let's maybe go this way. See if the ghost is there. Not. There's that sound again. Hold on, I'm getting a message. Let's go down. I'm going to start check the upstairs part with the infirmary stuff last. I mean, that's probably where I have to go. Which is why I want to check it last. Is there anything to get over here? Oh, cool. Well, actually, maybe we got to go this way. We got the, I like that the senior could just move cabinets. The jacket over his shoulder and everything. Found all the name tags. <laughs> I found the name tags in this chapter. Let's see. Yeah, there's very few left. 
I feel like that's a good indication that I'm probably close to the end of the chapter. Is that the janitor's closet? Oh, this is that girl we're chasing. Oh. That killer's probably nearby for sure. He's probably in this room. Maybe the killer is the custodian and he probably has cameras or something and he's watching all of us. That's just my theory. A game theory. Let's see what's to the left over here. Oh, that goes in. How the fuck do I get to that dead body? Dude, she looks fucked up. Is there nothing else over here? Did I miss an entrance we going down? Nope, that's all that's over here. I might have just needed to find that body and they might trigger something back over here. Just make sure I didn't miss anything. We're supposed to... Our rendezvous point's at 1A. Let's go check there. Check the classroom above and then I'll go to the infirmary area. Yeah, hey, bucket. This girl still needs a pee, by the way. Good morning, sunshine. Good morning. Good morning. My cat woke up. He's staring at me like this. Good morning. <laughs> He's just looking at me. You gonna go pee on another couch? I fucking hope not. Speaking of, I think I need to go do something really quick. I'll be back in like a minute. I'm trying to knock out this chapter as fast as possible. Wait, can you move this cabinet? It was worth a try. Is 
see if I could change anything over here. Nothing. Going to get another save in. That's you. Cat sneezed. All right, let's go to the infirmary area. I always knew that's where I'd end up. But I had to explore anyways. You never know. Never know. I do often wish there was a sprint button. All right, let's see what happens up here. Let's check this room out. Could even save right here really quick. So we're closer. In case something bad happens and I need to revert. Do it again. I'll be right here. Not a, where the hell do I need to go? I didn't have to go back in here. I thought that was the exit. Maybe I just gonna go back to the right wing. Maybe I gotta come to the left wing, see that body, and then go back to the right wing, maybe. Maybe that's what has to happen. I don't know. We're just running around in circles, essentially. Okay, we're back here. Let's go on another lap through here. Bow. I don't know what's up with the music room. Oh, he could lift this. <laughs> wow. What does that do for us, though? Like, what's the benefit of that? So we lifted that cabinet, but what does that do? Is there books in it? We read the note very early on about like turning each page 
in the cabinets. I don't know if the cabinets were the pages all along. Maybe I need to go to the yard room in the middle of where that was. And that's all it's there. Oh, we got our name tag. I don't know, man. I don't know. The only other thing I could think is maybe there's a specific body I gotta talk to that was actually his sister's that I found already, but he doesn't know. That's a potential... It's a potential theory on what to do. But... I think I'm going to have to end stream right now, unfortunately. So I think next time I'll pick this up, close out this chapter, and then do chapter four. I think that'll be the plan. Because I've been pretty much everywhere been in here the least nothing's going on other than she wishes she was a boy and so I sent the text I was like oh look he's streaming yeah about the end stream though all right let's just save here again and then I'll just come back to it next time maybe tomorrow maybe today I think Thursday or Friday I'll be streaming the right outro all right. Thank you guys for hanging out. I'll, I'll talk to you guys pretty soon.